how do you define radical joy? Um, I define it as um, being or feeling at home in, in yourself and who you are. Um, I think that like it sometimes it's hard to feel at home in who you are. Um, and I think that's radical to like find home in yourself and um, not like to look to the things around you necessarily to create that joy. Uh, and it's not easy, of course, um, but that's what makes it radical, I think. Yeah, I was gonna say a similar thing and also how like moving through obstacles and like discrimination with the sense of like resistance, but also like kind of knowing like maybe that your ancestors experienced the same thing. So there is hope for you and kind of understanding these horrible things, but also having a sense of like hope and joy in the face of oppression is kind of how I define it. That's really beautiful. Thanks for sharing that. Oh, Samantha is sharing who, wow. Is, is that your daughter, Samantha? That is so amazing. Hi. Can you tell us about your painting? Can you tell us what it's about? It's hot. It's hot. Oh my goodness. What made you draw hearts? What made you draw Sadie? She, Sadie's, um, Sadie's the um, prime example of radical joy because she's like a living sunshine. That's so good. Thank you. Thank you for sharing that with us. Yeah. Are those your, your favorite colors? Are those your favorite colors? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> My God. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, just the colors that you love. I love that. Uh, Samantha says, radical joy to me is being aware of the moment and making a mental note of things that bring me joy as they happen. I was just talking to my daughter. She wanted to tell you one more thing. What else? Do you think this is for Valentine's Day? <laughs> it's for yeah. Valentine's Day, she's saying. <laughs> so did you want to share at all what you, your idea of radical joy? My idea of radical joy has to be like probably being authentically yourself in any sort of circumstance. Sometimes like I could be like, I don't know, sometimes I'm like a lot. I'm like, some people say it's annoying. Some people say it's charming, um, but I'm always myself. I'm always authentically myself. And I think, you know, people who are around me hopefully experience joy because I'm happy um, and I always want to make other people feel good. So like just having a good time, being yourself, vibing, you know, radical joy is also good food. Um, so yeah, those are, those are, that's my recipe for radical joy.